What's up everybody, it is Royal J and I am back again with another video and this time I am doing a book review. But I'm doing a book review on Children of Blood and Bone. So let's go right ahead and get into it. So I'm not going to make this video too long. I'm going to get straight to the point. This is the book that I am reviewing, which is Children of Blood and Bone, made and written by Tomi Adeyemi. Uh, she has two. So currently I'm reading the second book, which is Virgin Vengeance, and I'm going to get a little bit into that, but not as much. I'm not going to go into very much detail because I don't want to give away the story because I'm, I'm sure that some of y'all haven't read it yet and you would like to read it, so I don't want to tell the story too much. But I'm just basically going to give my opinion and kind of give you a little backstory on what I've read. We have characters by the name of Zeli, Zeli, Amari, Ainan, Zayn, uh, Baba, Mama Agba, and a few more other people. Then you have the king and all that stuff. So Zeli is the main character, which is the one that you see on the cover of the book. Then you have Zayn, which is her brother. You have Baba, which is her father, and Mama Agba, which is kind of like her trainer, like a teacher or whatever, who's teaching her how to fight and stuff like that, you know? And it's based in Africa, which is so cool. That's what really drew me to the book because I really was getting into like Orishas and, and I was looking for books that could really help me with research with it. So I it just popped up on Amazon and I was like, oh, okay, I love this cover. It's really beautiful. So that's what made me really get the book. And once I started diving into it, I was like, oh my gosh. It's like, once you start, you can't stop. So it's kind of like you got to force yourself to stop <laughs> reading. It's just that good. Like I said, Zelie is the main character. She's on the front of the book cover on both. And then you have Zayn, which is her brother. Mama Agba, which is her trainer, teacher, you know, whatever. And then you have... Baba, which is her father. Then you have Amari, which is the princess, and then you have Ainan, which is the prince. Really, the king is the father of Amari and uh, Ainan. I hate that man so much. I'm just telling you guys right now, I really hate him, and you guys will hate him too if you read it. Basically, what it's really about is Zeli is trying to bring magic back to their land, and she's trying to bring it back, and she's really fighting really, really hard to bring it back with her, Amari, and Zayn, you know, coming together. Oh, and I can't forget my favorite, Nyla. Okay, Nyla is like a, I think she's the lion there or something like that. She's kind of like their protector, you know, you know, cute little fairy friend or whatever, and not, did I say fairy, furry, furry friend, I would say. And she protects them, she helps them, she goes everywhere with them. So it's really, really cute. I love Nyla. She has gotten them through so many things. Nyla is a true soldier here. Okay, let me just say that. You have that situation and the book is really cool, you guys. Like, I really loved it. I was reading it and I just really, 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 really was so interested with the story. Zeli is fighting to bring magic back. The king took the magic away long time ago and they're in a situation where they have to pay something like taxes every, I think every week or every month or something like that. Um, it's at the beginning of the book, so I don't really, you know, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. But they have to pay a certain amount for their, like, I think they're the Majis. But the king and the people over there and his soldiers and stuff call them maggots. And they don't like when they are being called maggots because it's very insulting to them. They have their staffs, they're fighting, and you know, Zeli is a little bit, she's a little bit feisty, okay? She's a little bit feisty and spicy, okay? She gets into it with one of the, the guards or the soldiers or whatever. Mama Agba is very strict. She's very strong, she's very strict, she's very hard. So she was really, really hard on Zeli because she's seen so much potential in her, you know? I love that part. It was It's towards the beginning, so when you guys do read the book at the beginning, you will get to that part, and it will lead into other things. So, after Amari, after Zayn and Zeli leave, because something really tragic happened, now, I'm not going to say, but something really tragic happened, which caused them to kind of like leave and travel. They find Amari, and Amari has a sunstone to bring back magic, and then they take it back to Mama Agba, and something else happens. The story, I'm just going to say what the story is because if I keep going in, I'm going to really tell y'all the whole book. Like, I'm not going to do that. But it's just basically, Zeli is bringing back magic and she's fighting and going through so much. It is her, Zayn, Amari, and they're just really fighting. They're really pushing through. Like, Amari 
would be a lot of people's favorite because she's she really took a risk you know and if you guys read the book you will know what i'm talking about so i love the book i love the story behind it i love the meaning the message of basically saying not give up you know there are so many obstacles that comes in front of us but we have to keep going no matter what and fight through it all and just be strong and be just be smart about the decisions that you make you know if you keep going and you keep fighting and you keep believing in yourself you will progress so you can't let things hold you back so i love this book i feel like it's really amazing and it's really 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 dope i think you guys should get it you guys should get it and read it you will really love it, it will. i love the book i love the story i love everything about it i think it's really cool and i can't wait for the movie to come out um it's supposed to be a movie for it don't know when it's going to come out, when it's supposed to be happening, but from the last interview that I've seen of Tommy, she said that they haven't found the character Zelly yet. So, the movie hasn't been shot as far as I've known, but I don't know. Hopefully, pretty soon, we'll be getting it. Hopefully, by next year or 2022. I don't know. So, make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and follow my social media down below in the description box, and click the bell to be notified when I upload, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you.